magic in the air today. It's Hilt magic. This is really special. With that basket, Jones goes over a thousand points in her Iowa State career. The Big 12's leading scorer in Ashley Jones. Couple of onlys to her credit. The only player in the nation averaging over 20 points and over 10 rebounds. And the only player in the Big 12 in the top five in points and rebounds. The Cyclones have numbers. Jones, Johnson. Jones to Johnson. Now she finds Scott for two. Off Scott. the glass. Ashley Jones at the top of the key. Williams is all over. 19 on the shot clock. Jones gets inside. Nice take by Ashley Jones. Can't coach that. What a play. A very physical game as Espen Miller McGraw will drive it in from the right side and put it off the glass for two. Thurman flying to the rack. She's just gashing the Texas defense right now. Brewer is stripped. Triple teamed on the block was Brewer. Ahead to Jones. Here's Johnson. One handed pass to Scott driving down the baseline and she finishes with the lay in. Good looking back your cut. Now with three to shoot, Nezakwa on a drive, banks him in! Esther Miller McGraw, nice stop, nails it. Boy, that is terrific offense. Rebound track down to Wise, five seconds to go in the half. Wise will drive it ahead. Madison to the right, Jones at the horn, and it's good, it counts! <laughs> Reverse layup, up and good, counted. Little crossover in front, now she has the angle. Good finish right there. Johnson driving inside the arc, spinning around the defender and laying it up and in with the left hand. She spun away from Williams down underneath, left her in the dust. Get the ball inbounded to Iowa State. How about that Espen Miller draw with the backdoor cut to Nezikwa. Meanwhile, on the other end came to a wide open bucket. Kristen Scott's not going to miss from there. That's the Miller McGraw just taking matters into her own hands on that. Band to band defense from TCU. Bounce pass to Jones in the high post. Dumps it down low for Wise, and she banks it in with a left hand. It's been awesome here in the fourth. Down low, great pass by Ashley Jones. Bounce pass to Nezikla. Nezikla to her right, dumps it. Down low for Camber, and she finishes. And count it. And the three-point play the old-fashioned way. Yeah, once you think you have her contained, like stop her there, she goes the other way, up and under move. Hands off to Jones, moving to the right. Jones looking to drive on De Carvalho. Spins, pivots around a couple times, then scoops it up and in somehow. That was a pretty short angle there for Ashley Jones. Back out to Espen Miller McGraw. She drives to the left into the lane, trying to back in on the defender, pivots around, and angles a shot in off the glass. Wise to Scott. Scott is making it look easy right now. To Camber, left wing will drive it in with the right hand. Her layup is good. Adriana Camber. Now with the left hand, gets in left block. Ashley, nifty move off the glass for two. Ashley Jones. Left, bounces down low for Kane. Kane dribbles past the defender, got the shot and the foul. Nezikwa in there now with six and a half to play. In the third quarter, nice soft pass underneath to Jones and one. The rebound to Neil Washington. She'll push it ahead. Frederick up the right side, bounce pass inside to Mills. Layup, good! Lauren Mills! Ray on the dribble, a screen from Kane. She spins into the paint, running left-hander off the glass and in. Despin Miller McGraw, nice defense. As Kane Beer on the left takes it herself. What a play by the freshman. A steal by Adriana Camber. Ball screen defense. You gotta love it. Thurman pushing the pace, drive into the hoop, and somehow gets by Celeste Taylor. Maggie finds Scott for two off the glass. Great pass by the freshman. Great follow through by Kristen Scott.
Iowa State has made it three. As nobody in a Cyclones uniform was missing from long range. They have multiple three-point shooters, and they were sharing the ball, and they were spacing the floor. I thought Ray Johnson was controlling the tempo of the game like we talked about earlier. It's going to be key for them and uh, created a lot of three-point opportunities. They had a perfect eight-for-eight eight shooting from long range. Ray Johnson to Scott for three. That's a well-marked three. Kristen Scott knocks it down. It's had to shoot. Ray Johnson fires a three for the lead. Yes! Again, Hilton on its feet. Ray Johnson clutch today. Rebound Iowa State out ahead. Camber for three right corner. It's good. Ring it up. Thurman. Scott. Oh, nice pass out to Madison Wise. Beautiful passing from Kristen Scott down low. Bounces to the corner. Espen Miller McGraw turns, throws oh! it to the basket and hits it. Maggie Espen Miller McGraw just threw that ball up there to beat the buzzer and swished it home. And here come the Cyclones with a head of steam. Another wide open three and make. Another one from Camber. Back to back triples for her. Now a wide open three for Scott. Drills it. On the inbounds, Kristen Scott. And Scott finds Wise. Johnson heaves one off, off, and buries it. Yeah, that is a dagger right there by Johnson. Up with it is Espen Miller McGraw. Off to Camber, a three. It's good! AD hits from the left side. Back to back threes for the Cyclones. Ashley Jones, you betcha. That's a pretty stroke from three. Iowa State in seven threes, and they've spread it around as well, which has been impressive. Here's another one. Frederick becomes the sixth Cyclone to hit a three so far here tonight. Five to shoot it. Ashley Jones gets rid of it. A three by Nezakwa. Good! Inez Nezakwa hits a three, and the Cyclones lead it. a three that's why you can't count this team out they can knock those down in a hurry i tell you what i do like watching his team's play what a game defensively as the cyclones go back up the right side it's espin miller mcgraw ray johnson for three good ray johnson iowa state has been on fire in the second half from beyond the arc brenda they're eight of 20 for the game moving the basketball taking advantage when baylor has gotten caught up in screens in the middle of McGraw to Camber. One bounce over to Jones. A wide open look. Got it. Ashley Jones. Shot clock winding down. Washington for three. Maggie puts it on the floor, tracks a double team, throws it out to Jones. Jones fires a three. Got it. Espen Miller McGraw up the left side, throws it to Camber. Camber thought about it over to Jones. Jones to Espen Miller McGraw for three. Good. Espen Miller McGraw in the clutch. So here we go out on the floor for Iowa State with seven on the shot clock. And we get the ball entered into Jones at the top of the key. She'll fire a three and hit it. Ashley Jones. Espen Miller McGraw lob. Oh. Well, it's picked up by Camber for three off the glass. The Walmart three by Adriana Camber. Wow. What a play. <laughs>
That's been Miller McGraw again this time knocks down the three only the third of the ball game for Iowa State. Jones and it's rejected by Cox again. Shot clock at five game near yes. Another extra opportunity for Iowa State where they take advantage and you love to see that the crowd is on their feet. by Jay Thurman going up and under. Who nursed it? Got clock at six. Thurman's got to do something. This for Miller McGraw. You want her to pull the trigger, and she does. Taya Cooper got caught just a little bit. That's where Espen Miller McGraw can hurt Baylor. Not by Ashley Jones with her second three-pointer of the afternoon. This Iowa State team, what a bounce back after not scoring a field goal in the second quarter right. to play with such heart here in the second half. Just remarkable. And then Johnson knocks down her first field goal of the afternoon, a big three. Johnson wants the pick, gets it, left hand, spins it off. That's why Bill Finley's so proud of this team this year. After all they graduated, Exactly. To win nine games and be at least 500 in Big 12 play. Johnson for three, got it! Iowa State has taken the lead. There's some health magic in the air today, Ron. Here's Cox, off balance shot, going into traffic, offensive foul. On Lauren Cox, and that'll be number four on her. Lauren Cox putting the ball down. Jones there. Yeah, Jones outside the arc in plenty of time. Dee Dee Richard knocked it away, then made the save, threw it on the inside, but I don't know if Baylor actually ever had possession. The officials are actually saying that Richards did have possession. Wow. By cupping it in her hand, had possession, so she saves it in to Iowa State. Should have been a new shot clock, so they gave Iowa State the basket. Wow. Johnson and Espen Miller McGraw there to get up a three. Cooper right there on the catch on Espen Miller McGraw. Johnson for three, yes! How about that? Ray Johnson playing with back pain, gutting through it. Sees a little bit of daylight and takes advantage. Jones dribbles off for me, five to shoot. Nezikwa way down. Oh my goodness! Her fourth three-pointer made this season. Iowa State leads. And the shot clock was completely down. But what a shot by Nezikwa over the outstretched arms of Egbo. There's some hilt magic going on today. Johnson needs some help. Now Person switches to Jones. Jones, double pump inside, off the glass, counted with 33 to play. By the way, with that basket, Jones goes over a thousand points in her Iowa State career. Any shot will do. Two or three. Watch the screening action. How does Baylor defend the screens? Alley oop. Jones. And a foul is called on Richards. Oh my goodness. They're saying Dee Dee Richards committed the foul. Huge, huge call. And Ashley Jones patiently waiting. There's only point one. Point one. So even if Baylor calls a timeout after a make on the second one, they'd only be able to tip on the other end. She may want to make one and miss the second. She may want to miss the second. Bill Finley tells his team, do not move. Do not move. Iowa State has upset the number two team in the country. Brenda Hilt Magic. Incredible game for Iowa State. Iowa State with the Hilt Magic today. What an upset in college basketball today. Iowa State wins at 57-56.